We begin tonight with a major upgrade coming to the Corpus Christi Police Department's 911 call center. Yes, yeah, City Council approved the first reading of an ordinance Tuesday that will bring more than $300,000 in grant funding to transition the system to a digital format. Brandon Schaaf spoke with city leaders and CPC, CCPD today about it. He joins us now in studio with our top story tonight. Hey, Brandon. Hey, good evening, Leslie and Rudy. And it is the first time in decades that the system will be replaced by CCPD. And right now, if there's an emergency, you can call or text 911 to have help dispatched to you. But in this new system, which is called NextGen 911, it builds on that, allowing you to send videos and photos to dispatchers the same way you would using your mobile phone right now. A real time view, if there is one of a video or a picture or whatever it may that it may have come in with that call, they'll have it available to them. Next Gen will replace CCPD's current analog system and bring some much needed upgrades to Metrocom. Metrocom is the Nueces County Public Safety Answering Point, which means CCPD answers calls from across the county. Deputy Chief Christopher White says Metrocom averages more than 500,000 calls a year. We know that information is critical uh, to solving problems, and so if an officer or an EMS agent um, has more information, maps, pictures, video. Once they get to the scene, they're going to be much more ready to respond and help our community. City leaders Peter Zanoni and Paul Guajardo say public safety is a top priority, making sure the police and fire departments have the resources they need. The Metrocom upgrades will be partially funded by a grant worth more than $317,000 from the Commission on State Emergency Communication. We have to make sure that we're always on top of how can we do better? And technology is a great part of that in any department, but especially when it comes to our 911 call center and public safety. White says the current 911 system was set up in 1991, and most calls came from landline phones. Now, he says 85% of calls are from a cell phone. CCPD is one of 70 departments getting the upgrade, which he says will help them work better with other departments. The end goal for Next Gen, Next Gen 911 is, is to be nationwide. So you can tie, you can tie this ability in terminals across the nation uh, to share information easier. And the city says that the new system will take about a year to integrate and will be done in phases as the city upgrades to high speed broadband. Now the next reading of the ordinance will be on October 25th. Leslie, Rudy, back to you. All right, thank you, Brandon.